Welcome back to Faria. We're continuing on our wild mission pack thing. So we're gonna give this another shot. We're using our neutral deck, so I am second. So I don't want that. That can disappear. So I have an idea of what I want to do. And then you can go there. Because then I'm going to go 1-1. One, one, or I'm going to see if I can cut him off. Okay, definitely going to have to go this way then. So step 2. Do I go... You know what? That's how I'm going to do it. And then this guy goes here. And that means we can place here. Um, we're eliminating this guy. You're probably going to attack him. Well, okay. So we're going to go one, two, hilltop ranger. And then we're going to go place this guy here, get that guy that. I'm going to end my turn. So, hold the line. Then we're going to place taunt here, and we're going to place taunt over there. And now, we're going to continue the backfill. So as long as we can keep this guy alive-ish, we can get two damage each time, which is good. But he can get rid of it. Yep. Okay, so now we've got this point right there. So now we end my turn. This guy's harvesting for us, which is fantastic. Now that we've got that, he hasn't placed anything, so he can place stuff here. God damn it. <gasps> but he didn't choose to. Sweet. Okay, so, it's pretty much a board clear, I have, I'm gonna be getting rid of this guy, because he's too strong, we're gonna eliminate him with that, and we're just gonna start drawing cards. So draw a card. This guy goes up here, because I want that damage. Okay. So, want Mace Man there, and Mace Man here. Because that's 7 damage hitting him up the front. This guy's here for a reason. Okay.
I draw a card. And we drop this guy here. Okay, this is working out a lot better than our previous attempt at this. Got rid of the big guy, he's only doing 3 damage. In 2 turns I kill him. That guy's there. So this turn I destroy and replace. Uh, let's just draw a card. Oh, brilliant. Let's just place that guy there. Don't need to worry because next turn is lethal. Next turn he's definitely dead if he doesn't eliminate that guy. Otherwise, I have this big guy that can we can kill stuff with fairly easily. But it's my turn. So we draw a card just to see what we get, and we got another one of the big guys, and dead. Success! Fantastic. Okay, so... Level up. Got a lot of this stuff. So, next one. Let's continue on with our neutral deck. Now, I've, I've been thinking about the world bosses, and I think I'm going to have to create a custom deck that is very good clear, and I know that the um, desert one, the desert cards, have clear, so those could work in our favour to help destroy. Okay, so his first two placements... And where's his next choice? Okay. Do I choose to get rid of that guy? You know what, we're going to place these down here like that. I'm going to place this guy here. I'm going to move there and go like that. And then you're going to do that. Okay. This should be helping us out now, so we're going to be at 8. Glad he moved there like that. So we're gonna have to do this, and we're gonna have to place a guy here to t kinda do. Ooh, okay. Hmm. Okay, so we do this. Let me in my turn. Turn. So we have a big guy that is out now. And you know what? I'm going to wait to play that guy, so we're actually going to move this guy here and go like that. And we're going to place this guy over here. And then we're going to fill in these last two spots. This guy's going to drop over down here, and now we're just going to 
collect Faria. Okay. So Death Touch is going over here, and then we go this. This guy pretty much is just, if you want to lose a guy, then lose a guy. And then... Draw a card, because I want to see what we get. Falcon Dive. Okay, we'll hold on to that. Um, you know what? We'll spend three. Just to... Get a gander at what's going on. He clears out that guy. That guy's cleared out. This guy... Okay... So, step one, step two, then this, oh. Okay, so Imperial Guard goes here. He goes like this. Here's the plan. That didn't work out. Kinda works, no it doesn't work out anymore. Bugger. So. You know what? You drop down there. We're gonna have to hit this guy. I'm gonna have to eliminate him. end my turn. He has 13 life, which is ridiculous. Eight and seven, that's a lot. Okay. Day of the Dragons. So this guy is going to drop down here. We're going to draw a card. Okay, that works out ish well. Whew. These big guys are coming out now. So, Mace Man drops down here. Me and my turn. Oh, you bastard. Okay. Eleven, he's got lethal. I'm dead. Burger. 
so 20 lands. You know what? Let's try it again. This time we're going to go with their green. You know what? White green. I'm going to try out white green. Okay, so. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, let's see what we get. Let's use replacement. Okay. So, we go one. No, I screwed that up. Oh, bugger. Oh well. End my turn. Okay. Let's see. Taunt goes here. You go here. We end my turn. here. We're going to go there. We're going to hit. And now, we'll place down another one. place down this guy here and we're gonna place this guy over here give this guy the life boost and you're gonna hit you are going to eliminate that guy I'm gonna end my turn I have lethal which is fantastic I'm going to draw a card for the fun of it. I'm going to place this guy down here. I'm going to place this guy over here. This guy's going to go and kill that guy. This guy's going to hit this guy. This guy's going to move across and clear. This guy's going to hurt this guy. And then we kill him. 
Okay, so second time was the better one. So 30 damage to a god. We need to play two more event cards. We've achieved something there. Um, okay, so yeah, that's going to be the end of this video. It was fun. We did some successes. Our green deck is, our green white deck is useful if we get going. So yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time.